Happy Monday, Boawia Desmond here. Thank you for tuning in. So today is Monday. I hope you had an opportunity to write out your activity goals for the week. What is going to help you move the needle down the road? So I titled my message today, Find Three Expanders in Your Life. So can you believe we've gone through the first 90 days of the year already? So time to think about the next 90. What do you want to do in the next 30, 60, and 90 days? And even just asking yourself these three questions, what do I want to um, continue doing? You know, because you've done it these last 90 days and it's worked so well for you. What do you want to stop doing because it really didn't work or serve you well? And then what do you want to start doing? So what do you want to continue? What do you want to stop? And what do you want to start doing in these next 30, 60 and 90 days? I think I'm going to break down my goals and just focus on, on maybe one or two things for the next 30 days and then pick up something else for the next um, in the in the 60 days and then 90 getting really good at something so that it um, helps me towards the goals that I'm trying to achieve because these 30 days went quick the next and these 90 days went quick the next 90 are going to go just as fast as these ones were so um, time to, to really focus in on the things that we want to do and when I talk about these expanders it's it's asking yourself who can expand my mind to the point where, you know, and is doing something that I want to achieve? Like who? And you know, one of the beauties though, really of being on, in, on platforms like Clubhouse, you're meeting people in there every single day who you otherwise would never meet. And they're adding so much value that you can learn or pick up a nugget or pick up something that can really help you in your own life, in your own business, in whatever it is that you're looking for. So find three expanders. The first, you know, find three people maybe who um, are doing what you are doing currently, that you can follow along as they are doing their journey because they're doing the thing that you want as well. And then look for three people who are um, past that. So they're a little bit ahead of, of that point and then find three people who are way ahead. These are the people who you look at right now and you're going, I wonder if I'll ever get to that level. But you know what, friend, they started right where you are, wondering the same thing, but knowing that anything um, worthwhile is uphill, as John Maxwell says. And, you know, just understanding that it just you need to just focus and stay, um, stay diligent to your plan. Stay diligent. What are the non-negotiables? What are the things that you're going to focus on that you're going to say, you know what, it doesn't matter. I'm not going to go to bed until I have this X, Y, and Z done. What are those things? Because those are the things that are going to help you move along and help you get to the goals that you have set for yourself. So finding those three expanders, you know, I think about um, John Maxwell and his story and how he started so late in, in his career in impacting people the way that he has impacted them today. He didn't start impacting people until after the age of 50. I think he was closer to 60. And think about that. Most people in their 60s are starting to slow down and starting to think about how they're not going to have to work or do anything anymore. But he wanted to make an impact. He wanted to add value to the lives of people. So find the expanders in your life. Somebody that's doing what you what you want to do so you can you can follow along, ride along with them. Somebody that has done something and is ahead of that person. And then somebody that's way ahead. Some that you can look to and say, you know what, someday I'm going to be able to do that as well. So I thank you for tuning in and I will see you tomorrow.